Hello my friends, it's Nina and today I am showing you some simple cute outfits for the summer. Right now where I live, we are actually still in lockdown and do I have plans to go out in these outfits? Not really, but maybe if I'm going out to grocery shop or walk my dogs or maybe if you're watching this video in the future when things are hopefully a little bit better, then these outfits could be useful to you. You can even wear these outfits at home, I would. My style is very simple and I wanted these outfits to be easy to recreate with clothes you probably already have. You can mix and match the clothes for different outfits as well. All details of each outfit will be in the description below but without further ado here are some outfits so the first outfit is a simple camisole over a button-up outfit i think pairing multiple items together makes an outfit more interesting and you really get to just play around with the clothes that you have i'm wearing this fun ruffle button-up shirt that i thrifted then i put on this black cropped camisole to give my outfit some shape which i also accentuated with a belt and of course i'm wearing mom jeans i am wearing these combat boots just to give the outfit an edgy touch which is something that i like to do as you will see sometimes in the video I think the ruffle shirt has an elegant look to it, so all the other pieces kind of balance the outfit out to make it a more casual and everyday look. This outfit is very easy to put together and you can play around with the colors, the types of shirt, things like that. You can wear a simple colored button up or a blouse. All I do is tuck the shirt away and then throw on a camisole right on top. It is definitely just a no fuss outfit. This outfit is kind of on the edgy side, but I've also included a version of this with a dress. Maybe you're not feeling like wearing pants, especially if the weather's very warm or maybe you're just in a dress mood. You can easily swap out pants for a simple mini dress. I like wearing spaghetti strap dresses for that summer look and you can wear whatever length dress you like. I think a black midi or maxi dress will look cool especially with the boots but this mini dress has a fun youthful look to it that again pairs well with a delicate ruffle top. This is just a variation to the first outfit that I wanted to include. A dress is easy to wear and run around in which is definitely good for summer. If the weather is really warm you can also swap out the boots for some comfy sneakers but again I just like how the boots complement the overall outfit and just create a vibe. And on to the next outfit. This has a sort of 90s look to it and it's actually one of my favorite outfits to wear as you've seen in some of my past videos. I am wearing a cropped cardigan with a cropped camisole underneath and some wide leg jeans to give the outfit a comfortable casual look. I'm wearing white sneakers because I literally wear them all the time and it goes great with any outfit. Have fun with pairing different colors together whatever matches your style and aesthetic. The possibilities are endless. This is a pretty trendy outfit. I've seen lots of people wear it and I just think it's a cute look. If your camisole or shirt is too long for your liking, you can tuck it up. You can button or unbutton the cardigan. It's up to you. I actually tend to not wear a top under. I just button up the cardigan and wear it as a top on its own. But with the warmer weather, it's nice to have layers that you can put on and take off. This is just one of my favorite outfits. And moving on, here I am wearing a floral dress. Now, to be honest, dresses tend to make me feel shy just because they're not really my style. Although they are cute and perfect for a beach day or just in general a summer day, maybe the dress length is not to your liking or you just want to do something more. So here's my solution tuck the dress into some jeans. Throwing on a pair of jeans and tucking a short dress into it is a popular and easy way to make a second outfit out of your dress. I'm wearing these distressed jeans to kind of contrast with yet yeah, complement the floral pattern of the dress. It's basically like you're wearing a blouse on top except you have a dress under. This is just if you have a dress that you don't really wear a lot and you want to put it to use. And if the weather is breezy or you just want to have layers then you can throw on a cardigan. I like a nice brown cardigan for those grandma vibes but I also think the colors look good together. You can never go wrong with layers, but this is only if the weather is not too warm. And picture this, maybe you had a long day and you want to go to the beach. This is for when everything's safer though, of course. You can just take off your jeans and now you have a true summer outfit. Multiple outfits in one. We love to see it. Big brain energy. These are just other simple ways to wear a dress. A dress on its own though is cute and freeing and of course easy to wear. The day that I safely get to go to a beach, I'm bringing this dress out. But also if you feel like dressing up at home, dresses are the way to go. They're so comfy. For the next outfit, it, we have a midi skirt. Such a simple piece that you can pair other pieces with to make an outfit. I like to wear a midi or maxi skirt with a simple half sleeve t-shirt to give the overall outfit a laid back sort of look. I like half sleeve shirts not because it covers my eczema but because it has a trendy look to it that I especially see a lot in Asian fashion. It's good for those days where it's not too warm, not too cold, just right. I like to tie up my shirt but you can also simply just tuck it in. This outfit is just a chill vibe. It's easy to throw on but it looks like you 
you have yourself together. Skirts come in all shapes and colors, just have fun with them. The next outfit includes a plaid skirt. I think plaid skirts are fun and they can look good with just a plain old t-shirt. This is as simple as an outfit can get, but you can really play around with the color themes, your accessories, your tops, maybe your outerwear. I just threw on a nice bucket hat. I can imagine this as a concert look, but unfortunately we're not going to a concert for a good long while, but when that day comes, I guess I'm prepared. I also like how my toes socks match my outfit. It's just the little things sometimes. Moving on over to the next outfit, we have the same t-shirt, but now paired with overalls. Overalls are a great summer look. If you have the right ones, they can be nice and comfortable. I like to put one strap on to make the look asymmetrical and a little more interesting. Like, why does she only have one strap on? Who knows? I'm mysterious. Just kidding. I thrifted these overalls and I'm just wearing some high top converse to make the look fun. I just put on a bucket hat to give the outfit an extra something. Then I got reminded of Hobie's outfit from Muster. A lovely coincidence. A pair of overalls is a nice thing to have in your closet. You can pair it with a long sleeve shirt, a striped collared polo shirt, a crop shirt, a tied up t-shirt, anything you want. It's great to just throw on if you don't have other ideas. And now we are moving on to the next outfit which includes a midi dress. A midi dress or maxi dress can give a dramatic elements to an outfit and now I'm pairing a simple colored blouse with a dress to make it a nice coffee date kind of look for when we can actually have coffee dates again. And by coffee dates, I mean days where I go to a cafe by myself. I'm wearing this floral midi dress with combat boots. Again, I just love to wear combat boots with pieces I find on the elegant or delicate side. I think they just complement each other well. You could fully button up your shirt, but I feel that letting it open just makes the look more laid back. And of course, if boots aren't really your style or you want to wear something else, a pair of sneakers works just as well. They make the outfit more casual and it's just comfortable. I enjoy this outfit. You can wear different patterns, different colors. These outfits are completely adaptable to your own taste and style. Moving on to the next outfit, I am wearing an oversized plaid flannel shirt over a camisole and a denim skirt. By the way, if you aren't a skirt kind of person, you can easily substitute the skirt for shorts. It's just personally for some reason I don't find shorts very flattering on me, so I tend to wear just long pants or skirts and dresses of various sizes. I think this is a nice summer look. It looks like you're going to a picnic or the beach. It's also a great outfit to wear at home. It's just great vibes and it's so comfortable to wear. A plaid flannel shirt is another closet essential for me because it is so versatile. I think this outfit is fun and definitely very easy to recreate as well. And here is the final outfit. This is a more formal look and by formal I mean I just throw on a plaid blazer over a very comfortable outfit. A plaid blazer is a closet essential for me because you can really dress up with it yet still maintain an everyday casual look. With a blazer I am wearing wide leg jeans and a white camisole but a nice white t-shirt goes well with this outfit as well. I'm wearing some Converse shoes to keep that casual look and I have my hair in a low ponytail. You can wear the plaid blazer with a matching pair of bottoms that would make a powerful look or you can wear a solid color as well. I love to mix and match my clothes so I think in general it's just nice to have some solid pieces that can go with anything and everything. That is pretty much it for the summer outfits video. I hope you enjoyed it. I enjoyed getting to dress up again. I hope you are staying safe and healthy and I will see you in my next video. Bring it in for a virtual hug and goodbye my friends. Bless me.